we'll, we'll, we'll uh, me and my dad and Coach Miles and all the other coaches will, will come, we'll come together probably at the end of the season and uh, wait to wait the options and you guys will find out. So any different emotion going into Saturday, nah, maybe? Not at all. I just want to go in there, um, hope to get a couple of interceptions. Hopefully, <laughs> you know, if they try me or anything like that. But I just want to just want to go out there and continue helping this ball, this ball club win games. And that's my that's my ultimate goal for this season. When is uh, when is nothing against you? When is Tyran Tyran going to start? Returning when he's going to kick? When well. he's going to start returning kicks? <laughs> Actually, we were, we were trying to get him in there um, um, Saturday, but um, Coach, Coach Gerard asked me was I all right because I actually wanted to play a little destroyer, something I did the last two years. He's like, I don't want to hurt you and all that stuff. So. Uh, he'll, he'll get a shot. He'll get a shot. It's um, it, it, it just a matter of time. Speaking of hurting somebody, that the, the block that uh, Jai made for you on that punt return, did you hear uh, it? Yeah, I mean, I was did. that something? I mean, the, the, did it sound more <laughs> than what you? Hear. You know what I'm saying? Did you, that's why I'm getting it. Did it sound more more than a usual hit? Man, that, you probably didn't see it. But. I didn't see it, but it felt like I saw it and heard it. Like I, it just went through my body. You know, once I heard it, boom! I like, oh. <laughs> felt like I felt like I got hit a little bit, but uh, Jai, we we saw it um, this morning. Jai made a, uh, like a huge, huge block, uh, probably the hardest hit Jai ever made in his whole football career. <laughs> <laughs> how, how was Ty able to, to roar past you there uh, on that play when, when he when he laid that block? Actually, when I ran across the field, I was like, oh man, I, hope, I saw like five ULM guys. Like I hope somebody just come out of nowhere and just lay a block with Ty. So here. you were holding back a little bit? Yeah, well, okay, I really okay. wasn't. Running as fast because I knew I wasn't going to outrun five of those guys when I only had I got you. Um, not too much space on the sideline. So Tyron, he told me uh, he came out of nowhere. He wanted me to get he wanted to get me in the end zone, but that check gas light came on. And, you know, <laughs> How many yards did that cover? Because I know you ran across the whole field. So uh, one thirty-five. It felt like five hundred yards, but. Yeah. I, I don't know how many yards it was, but I, I just know I was running for my life trying to get in this end zone. You probably made the 80-some thousand people nervous. You were just laying on the ground there. But, but so I was hurt. tired. I was tired. But the ULM they, on the training staff was telling me not to get up. I'm like, I'm okay. Just let me roll over and get up. But uh, they thought I was hurt, so I'm all right. <laughs> that's the longest return in school history that's not a touchdown. Say it again. That's the longest return in school history that's not a touchdown. <laughs> is, that a, is that a compliment or not? <laughs> It's definitely not a compliment because the goal was to get in the end zone, but uh, I'll take it if, it if it is. You think the ULM staff wanted you to be hurt, maybe? Yeah. <laughs> they, probably, they, they, they probably did, but um, I, I know those guys probably don't wish an injury on, uh, upon anybody, but that, that game was actually fun and the defense came to play. Your, your own teammates waved at the trainers on, on your sideline, so well, those of us who are watching won. Yeah, because uh, I think Chance was trying to flip me over, but the other guy was holding me down. Uh, ULM trainer was uh -huh. telling me don't get up, so I was trying to roll over, uh -huh. and he was holding me down and chance at the same time. So I'm like, I'm all right, just let me go. So <laughs> <laughs> they won't let me go, and I, eventually when I turned up, I got up. All right, does anybody ask you if this is going to be your final home game? Everybody asked me, <laughs> <laughs> but um, I don't know. I don't. Know. This, this is my final home game for this season, but we will have to see what um, what things what things bring until the, these next couple of weeks. I mean, we have to. Me and Coach Miles, my, my family, we have to sit down and, and see how things is um, direction, what good direction is pointing in. So we'll come up with a decision um, sooner later. You had talked a lot before the year about bucking that trend of losing to Bama and Ole Miss and Florida, and now you'll have that chance to sweep them. Just talk about what that means. Oh, man, it's, it's, it feels good. I mean, I've been telling you guys I feel good about this team from the beginning. You know, although we, we, we are still young, but we have so much talent. It's the most talent I've ever been around since I've been playing football my entire life. I mean, this team is special. They have an edge, they have a drive. I mean, these guys want to win ball games. And since from now we were playing Florida, got that big win, played Alabama, got a huge, another big win, and now it's Ole Miss. So we know these guys definitely want to go out there and get a victory as well. So I don't expect nothing less from this football team, and I know we're going to go out there and play our heart out.